Hello again, Craig from the Prepper Stop here, prepperstop.com. Um, I'm going to talk with Dave about uh, dosimeter charge of this particular model. Uh, if you don't know what dosimeter is, you're going to have to go back and look at a previous video that was already done. This is a dosimeter charger model uh, 5, basically 5A, 5B, different manufacturers made, and this is, allows you to reset the dosimeter. But there's this one here, which is actually really interesting and rather unique. If you'll notice, the logo on it has a Civil Defense logo. But it also has a FEMA designation. Now that's really unusual. There can only be a narrow range of time in the mid 80s when that could have happened. And this is the Model 6, 750-6. It's not very well known, but it's a really excellent unit if you have a chance to pick up one of these. There are a lot more expensive though. Here's a dosimeter. Basically, I'll show you briefly how I use it. It goes in top, on top of here. This trigger makes this slide. See, right now it needs to be adjusted, so I push it in. And then I release the trigger. Now it's ready to, I basically look through the light. And I press this lever, and it's no batteries operated here. It's piezoelectric by action of this lever. So I squeeze the lever. It brings the needle back to zero and beyond zero. If it goes past zero, then you push this little button here, and it releases the, the static charge, and it can be put to zero. It's very precise, very nice operating unit. If you have, if you really serious about having to set a lot of dosimeters, this is the way to go, even though they are so much more expensive. So that's about it for the Model 6. Uh, my name is Craig for VidKnowledge.info or theprepperstop.com. Thanks for watching.